Quem cultiva a semente do amor, segue em frente e não se apavora, se na vida encontrar de sabor. Wait a second. I think he just caught him with that elbow as well. To be to get this fight up right. He had an opportunity of coming inside that close guard. Oh, nice elbow. Chandler working off that jab. Oh! Chandler's in the Trying to complete his mission in Dustin Poirier. Now an elbow from Charles. Oh! Oh, Dustin hurt him quick. The front kick to the liver. Wow, those are lands, right? 56 to the head for Poirier in round one. Julian! Ow! He's looking for an arm bar. Yep. See the way he's pulling the glove like that? Oh, man, oh, my goodness. He's cuffing, he cuffed his fingers yeah. underneath the glove to achieve that position. Didn't seem as though Poirier protested the glove grab. I mean, we'd have to look at it real closely, but in my eyes, that's what was happening. Oh, it's just not fair. What are you trying to do if you're Poirier here, Joe? Oh, fuck. Well, either off. Yeah, it looks nice to me it, like yep. he's holding it illegally. Perhaps a Kimura, <laughs> maybe a guillotine, but for, for the most part, when you see a guy doing that, they're just holding on. Oh, he's getting beat up here by Charles Oliveira. This is slicing across his head. Because if they start to slice, they'll start right. to split him off and they rip his face apart. Right. But I mean, Charles Oliveira has really put it on Dustin Poirier in the second round. And That's a good point, Dean. He told us in our fighter meeting against Khabib Nurmagomedov, perhaps he should have been content to lose the round instead of forfeiting a position that resulted in the end of the fight. So, for Charles Oliveira. Oh, Charles is good oh, my here, my goodness. goodness. This is his move. It's under the neck. He's going to Charles Oliveira. Doubt him now, folks. Wow. Charles Oliveira maintains the throw.